Our next nominee for Entrepreneur of the Year is changing the vaccination game on a global scale. They are PharmaJet. PharmaJet's a needle-free jet injection technology, and we focus on immunizations, in part because we're committed to global health. But along the way, we determined that we could probably improve the immune response using our fast fluid injection. So we've proven that, and we've also proven that we can reduce the dose of vaccine by moving from the muscle to the skin, so stretching supply and saving money. What's unique about PharmaJet is that there isn't another PharmaJet, and we've been at this for the last, in earnest, you know, 12, 15 years of development of our technology, and we have the ability to protect it through patents. We have about 48 different patents that are issued, more that are pending. We have a number of trade secrets. What we do to create that fast fluid injection is really hard to engineer, so we're proud of that. And then if you add on top of that, the regulatory claims, FDA, CE mark, WHO pre-qualification, those are for devices. And then the icing on the cake is that we have clinical claims, which means that we've gone through the clinical studies in humans to be able to prove that our vaccine delivery is safe, efficacious, and in some cases, superior in immune response to needle-based delivery. So we compete generally with needles. Um, we're in a unique category where there's so many barriers to entry for someone to follow PharmaJet. But the truth is, is that we'll never replace needles altogether. And where we focus is where we excel. Either we can reduce the dose by moving from the muscle to the skin, and the immune response is the same or better, or we can make certain vaccines and cancer therapies work better by virtue of our fast fluid injection. So the science behind what we do is lots more than simply getting rid of the needle. And we're proud to be associated with bringing vaccine and therapeutic cures to market to help more people as time goes on. Given that Colorado is a pretty special place to be, um, I think that we've had benefit of people who like to live here and work here and all decide that actually Jeffco and the, the ability to commute to where we are, which is where all the highways kind of converge, is really convenient for everyone. So we employ a, a very high or highly educated population and people who can discern, you know, where they want to be, what they want to spend their time on. We've been blessed by having really good access to really highly qualified people. We've had amazing mountains to climb and valleys to go through, but it's a really rewarding journey and particularly rewarding through the impact that we have in um, helping cure disease, things like polio, keep people safe, things like COVID, um, influenza shots, et cetera.